Hi, and welcome to City Agogo, coming to you from the downtown Seattle YMCA's Triangle Art Gallery. We'll tell you more about their current exhibit in our calendar. We've got a great show. If you're a fan of John Philip Sousa, get ready to rock. And first, visionary artists John Sutton, Ben Barris, and Zach Culler are hitting the road with their newest mobile performative installation. This piece is called There Goes the Neighborhood. Uh, it's a mobile environment on the back of a flatbed trailer. It's uh, a living room environment. We got a grant through King County for Culture Performance Art Network, and it's going to be touring King County through November. A lot of the themes that we've come up with have to do with home, what makes a home. No matter what piece we're working on, we tend to sit down and actually live in that space for a period of time. You guys want to order a pizza? We've decided to take uh, our art outside of the gallery realm and to take it and confront the viewer, basically, um, to take the art to the people instead of having them have to seek it out. Is watching TV actually an act of like, is it an activity or is it a non-activity? It depends on what you're watching. <laughs> I guess the hopes for somebody looking at this piece would be that they would kind of look at it and find humor in it, that they would see a reflection of themselves in some way, that they would maybe question how they spend a majority of their time sitting in front of a television or surrounded by family and what does that idea of like family room or home or neighborhood, community mean to them. We're the Ballard Sedentary Sousa Band. We're a community band and we've been in Seattle for 20 years. We play mostly marches, but we don't want to march. We would rather play all of the notes than to drop some of them as we're walking down the street. John Philip Sousa in his day was more famous than any three bands that I can think of today. Seventeen years ago we decided that we needed to wear uniforms, but we didn't have to wear uniforms that were all the same, and someone found a thrift store that had a bunch of uniforms, so we all selected things that suited our personalities. What? Sousa and his contemporaries Fillmore and King, their music can't be beat. And now for the details. One, two, one, two. To find out when There Goes the Neighborhood will be in or near your neighborhood, go to SuttonBerezColor.com. Grab your baton and march to Town Hall on Sunday, November 6th at 2 p.m. for a musical birthday bash celebrating John Philip Sousa and the band. Call 523-6129 to find out more. The classic American play, Death of a Salesman, runs now through November 6th at Langston Hughes Performing Arts Center. Directed by Jacqueline Moscow and featuring an all-African-American cast, this production is not to be missed. For information, call 684-4758. And finally, Summer Artifacts, an exhibit of edgy and colorful artwork created by teenagers in the Seattle Academy of Fine Arts Summer Arts Program runs through October 28th at the downtown YMCA's Triangle Gallery. For hours and directions, go to seattlefineart.org. Miss something? Not to worry. Go to seattlechannel.org. That's it for the show. Thanks so much for watching. And as always, we encourage you to get out there, try something exciting and new, and experience the awesome power of art. We'll see you next time.